This is a brand new USB puzzle and it was designed by a new puzzle designer whose name is Luke Ware, he's from United States. This puzzle is made from aluminum, brass and stainless steel and the goal is to remove a tiny flash drive that is hidden inside. This puzzle has a very nice pocket size, it is a little bit bigger than a matchbox and it gives you extra security for your USB flash. This puzzle has quite a simple design, it has three knobs on top, two openings on the left side, two on the right side and one larger opening on the bottom where the USB flash is and you can't easily remove it. You can try to tap it, you can try to hit it really hard but the USB drive is secured inside quite well. So the only way to remove it is to solve the puzzle. It is one of the first copies of this puzzle and it was sent to me for testing but as soon as I tried it I said that you have to make more of them and sell them since people will love it. If you like the USB puzzle and you want to buy it, link will be in the video description as always. And if you want to see my attempt to solve this puzzle, keep watching the video. So let's try to solve the USB thumb drive puzzle. It looks quite interesting and very well made. There are three knobs here on top. Oh, I can, I can unscrew all of them, okay. Let's try to do that. Oh, they are long. At least the first one is very long. <laughs> It is too long. Oh my god. And I think that is it is it. oh done. Okay. That was very long. Let's try to unscrew the second one. Ah, uh, it feels long as well. Oh my god. Oh, this one is short. Okay. And what about the last one? Is it long or short? Oh, it looks long as well. Or maybe even longer than the first one. Let's see, it is exactly the same as I see. Okay, now, oh, there is something inside. It is moving. Okay, and there is a USB drive here. So I guess I have to kind of push it from this side. Oh, maybe that, that's what I have to do. I have to grab the long bolt. Uh, Okay, no, nothing happened. Something is still moving inside. Okay, there are there are four more openings. This one has a thread, but it looks much bigger than the bolt. Hmm. I don't know what it is for. Maybe there is another bolt somewhere hidden. Here there is another thread, but it looks like there is a bolt inside already. Maybe that's how the inner mechanics is fixed inside, I don't know. Maybe these two holes are not about the solution. Okay, let's try to put the bolt here and see what happens. Oh, it goes only so much deep inside. Oh, and now nothing is moving. Oh, okay, let's, let's try to check what is happening inside. There is some kind of a pin. It moves in all directions. Left, right, up, down. Hmm. I think that I have an idea. There is some kind of a pin. Maybe it's not a pin. Maybe it is something bigger than a pin. But it is a thing that I have to use to push the thumb drive out. So maybe I'll try to put one bolt from this side. Another bolt I can put from this side. I believe it won't go deep as well. Oh, it goes even less. Oh, wait a second. I can, when I move one bolt, when, when I unscrew it, I can put the other in. Maybe I'm holding something, the pin, and maybe I can put it in. Oh, I don't think that this short one is supposed to be here. Maybe I have to change short and long. Yeah, it goes all the way in, but it doesn't make any sense. So maybe I have to move the pin with two bolts, and then with the third one, I have to push it in so that it will remove the thumb drive. Okay, let's try to work on this idea. I'll put the smaller bolt here. Let's see how deep it goes. It goes so deep, okay. And now I try to put this one here since it is much longer. 
and I guess if the pin is in the correct position, I can push it in. Oh, the ball goes all the way in and nothing really happens. Okay, now I have to remove it. So what is happening inside? There is definitely some kind of a pin, now it moves. But when I tighten the bolt, it stops and it doesn't move. But as soon as I loosen the bolt, it moves again. Okay, how it works. So there is a chamber inside where the pin moves. What if I put one long bolt all the way in so that I can push the pin to the wall here? Uh, no, it didn't happen. I don't know what to do. Oh, that is a fun way to unscrew the bolt. It saves some time. Maybe I'll try to put the pin somewhere here. So the chamber is divided into two parts now. So maybe I can put this one here now and let's see. Oh, the pin isn't moving now. Okay, let's try to put this bolt here. Maybe the pin is blocked somewhere between the bolts now. No, it doesn't seem like, oh, the pin is too large. Oh, maybe my idea is wrong. According to the sound, it feels like the pin is right in this position now. But I might be wrong. I'll put the long bolt here and see where it goes. It goes all the way. The pin is moving. Let's try to put the other bolt. Looks like it works. Now I can move both bolts and the pin doesn't move. Oh, maybe now I'm... Oh, it feels like the pin dropped in the hole. Oh, let's try to put the third bolt inside and check if my solution is correct. If I can remove the USB drive. No, 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 no. Something is wrong. Wait a second. There, there are two bolts inside now and they have a different length. So uh, the one on the right is smaller. It is shorter. It is like this short and this one is long. So maybe I have to put the short one all the way in and only then the pin will be somewhere in the middle. Okay, let's try again. So maybe now I'll try again. <gasps> oh, done, done, Woohoo! finally, okay. I was able to remove the USB stick, okay. That's quite a fun puzzle and I can see there is a pin there and it looks like it is not in exact middle, it is a little bit to the left. I'm wondering if I can remove the pin. Oh, I can even remove it. And that's the part that I was chasing inside. Now I have to stick it back inside and I can put the USB stick in and remove all the bolts to complete the solution of the puzzle. And that's it, the puzzle is solved both ways. That was my time to solve the USB puzzle. It was recorded about two months ago when I got the puzzle, but I decided to wait until this puzzle will be available for sale and only then post my video. So if you like this puzzle and you want to buy it, link will be in the video description. Or maybe you watched the entire video and you want it just because it's an extra security for your flash drive. You can buy it using the link in the video description. Thank you for watching my video. See you next time.